Hi there, welcome back to our channel. In this video, we're taking a look at some incredible electric motorcycles you have to see. But before we get into the video, we want to take a moment to thank each of our viewers for their continued support. It's an honor to bring each of these videos each week and the greatest inventions that the tech world has to offer. We truly appreciate your support. You guys are awesome. And now, let's jump into the video. First on the list, let's take a look at Damon Motorcycles. One of most people's concerns when it comes to riding a motorcycle on the roads is how dangerous it could be when involved in a collision. Damon Motorcycles has invented a motorcycle that will not only deliver a smooth ride that has improved comfort, but the technology in the motorcycle also scans the road continuously to alert of any hazards on the road, such as the driving of other cars around you called the Advanced Warning System for Motorcycles. Awesome. Meaning that the more that you ride on a Damon motorcycle, the safety will continuously improve by learning the patterns on the road of what contributes to road accidents in order to prevent them. In addition, thanks to a cloud system, the technological data collected from other riders on Damon motorcycles is also used to help improve the safety measures of your ride as well. Next on the list, the Ultraviolet F77. The Ultraviolet F77 is an electric motorcycle that, similar to Damon Motorcycles, wants to deliver a unique riding experience by adding technology that allows the motorcycle to adapt to the rider, as opposed to the other way around. In addition, the Ultraviolet F77 app, available on both Android and iOS devices, allows for riders to pair their device to the motorcycle to fine-tune their riding experience giving them hands-on control over settings such as understanding how much energy they can serve while braking or driving in specific ride modes. In addition, the mobile app also connects riders to the Ultraviolet F77 charging network, listing all charging points that are nearby. The Ultraviolet F77 reaching at least 80% charge within 3 hours on a standard plug and can get a full charge in 1.5 hours on a fast charger. With three battery packs, the Ultraviolet F77 can carry up to 150 kilometers in range and reach a speed of 60 kilometers an hour in less than three seconds. Up next, the Melander SM250. The Melander SM250 is an electric dirt bike created in Moscow, Russia that is defying what traditionally has been possible for a dirt bike. With the ability to reach a top speed of 120 kilometers an hour, reaching 100 kilometers an hour in four seconds, this bike can also work well underwater, potentially. The Melander SM250, such as many other electric vehicles, is completely sealed from the elements, which could theoretically allow this motorcycle to comfortably thrive through water. It's been tested and it's not perfect, as the rider in the demonstration did face some challenges as the wheels filled with mud, the main reason that Electric, the company behind the Melander SM250, created the bike was to offer an alternative to dirt bikes that are fueled by gasoline while also delivering a quality product that will last longer than bikes with traditional combustible engines. Next, Revo NEX Electric Street Bike. Kimco is no stranger when it comes to creating electric vehicles that are unique, and the Revenex is no different. The Revenex Street Bike is a system that has quite a lot of power, with the ability to go from 0 to 100 kilometers an hour within 4 seconds flat, and can go from 100 to 200 kilometers an hour in less than 10 seconds, all powered by a 6-gear manual gearbox. Needless to say, the Revenex is charged with some major power that will get you from point A to point B. Kimco is continuously aiming to redefine what is possible in motorbikes and the overall experience that riders have, implementing features such as Kimco's designed launch control, a feature that ensures that the Revenex and other bikes in the Kimco fleet always have a perfect launch each time that a rider takes off which allows the riders to focus completely on having the ultimate riding experience each time they get on the Revenex.
Next, the Zero SR electric motorcycle. The Zero SR electric motorcycle is a force to be reckoned with on the roads and has enough power to out-accelerate a Porsche. The battery life on the Zero SR is remarkable. A fully charged battery has the ability to last nearly 10 hours of driving time and the approximate amount it costs to charge the battery each time is less than two US dollars. The starting price of this motorcycle starts at around 15,000 US dollars, which isn't a bad price, especially if you live in a place where you can collect incentives for driving an electric vehicle like the Zero SR. As the Zero SR is a completely electric motorcycle like the others on this list, when you factor in the numerous areas where routine maintenance is no longer required, such as replacing the clutch or fueling up on gas, when you look at the benefits that the Zero SR electric motorcycle has to offer, the choice is simple. Up next, Savic has released an update to the prototype that was shared last year. Designed to be a precision racer, Savic's latest release of the Generation 2 prototype is leaving a lot of people with high hopes for what's to come. Designed by Australian designer Dennis Savic and his team, the first prototype had a number of design flaws, such as the initial square casing of the battery pack would scrape on the ground when rounding corners, a problem that presents a clear safety concern. In fact, the design team went back to the drawing board to address this along with 150 additional concerns raised by customers when the first prototype was released. On the second generation, Savic said goodbye to the squared off battery box, the original seat was deemed too narrow and has been rounded, and Savic has added their own 8 inch display and added additional tools on the bike such as advanced braking systems and regenerative braking. While there have been huge improvements with the release of the second generation, Savic's team is still working hard to fine tune their creation to the last moment. Next, we're taking a look at the Kalk and from Swedish company Cake. If you're a fan of unique design that comes with versatility, the Kalk and is an electric motorcycle that's worth considering. Starting at $14,000 US dollars for the standard one battery motorbike, the Kalk and was designed to navigate through the tight streets of a crowded city and also to conquer the terrain of off-roading. The Kalk and can reach a top speed of 90 kilometers an hour and has a range of three hours on a single charge while riding on trails and around 86 kilometers when riding through the city. On a standard outlet, Kalk and can completely charge a single battery in just over two hours. What's driven Cake to create this line of electric motorbikes is the desire to create lightweight off-road motorbikes that evolve from the technology of traditional motorbikes, making an option that's more environmentally friendly compared to a combustible engine motorbike. Closing off the list, BST's Hypertech Electric Motorcycle. With a design that's sure to make a scene, the Hypertech is one electric motorcycle that's sure to make an impression every time. Designed by Pierre Terblanche, who has also drafted up some of the model designs of a few Ducati and a number of other motorcycles over the past era, the Hypertech is completely built by hand to ensure precision and passion of the BST is placed into every model. The Hypertech is able to quickly charge on a standard outlet in half an hour, by far the fastest charging time of any motorcycle on this list, which can last for approximately 300 kilometers. The body of this motorcycle is pretty sturdy at 205 kilograms, ensuring that you'll feel grounded when you're riding on the Hypertech. The frame also being made out of carbon fiber. If you're interested in the Hypertech, it's going to be a bit of a wait as the BST team is still conducting testing and reconfiguring the design on this innovative motorcycle. However, there's no denying that the Hypertech would be worth the wait. Thanks for watching this video. I hope you enjoyed it, and if you want to learn more about any of these electric motorcycles, links will be in the description box below. If you enjoyed this video, be sure to give the video a thumbs up and hit the subscribe button to make sure that you don't miss out on any future content. Take care.